Hi, everybody. My name is Corey Coppola. It's my company, Flow Water. And I love the theme that's been expressed. We've got safety concerns. We've got heat for the user. And we have maintenance. A lot of areas are very important. That's why it's getting emphasized here. My products have been designed to be easiest to install and easiest to do maintenance with water quality as priority number one. Ready? Okay. With water quality is priority one. I'm going to start right now. Mine's not the end all be all. If you have silty loams like you do here, you're putting a different sack in here or you're bringing flocculants in to deal with those issues. If you have carbons, nitrates, phosphates, silica, you bring another media prior to to deal with it when we're talking dewatering and in some of these cases, especially industrial. But what I'm going to start out by showing you is my original easy catch. Edge to edge, completely recessed under the grate. Tabs go between the grate and frame. Sorry, it's a demo, it's been beat around. And they adjust both ways. So you can handle eight, nine different sizes with this. Sorry, I've been beating it up. We have round adjustable, where it goes back and forth, same premise, lock them in place. Both sets, the bags Velcro off after 18, 20 clean out so you can replace it and have water quality. Not just a band-aid there. I can scream. Can you hear me okay if I yell? <laughs> okay, and then here's one that goes 18 inch by 18 inch up to 32 inch by 32 inch. And if you want to come or look here, we've done some tests and you're seeing it's catching the solids and such. Still going to get some dirty water because it's that sandy, silty loom. Wrong fabric I brought. Sorry, but the frame and facilitating any fabric in there is what it's done. Ours flow at 192 gallons a square foot a minute. We're capturing 91.6% of the sediment. Once you get the cake layer in, the more fines get caught as you're seeing here. But across the country, this has been rocking. Here, we'd have to adjust. Then we have our magnet on top where you don't even pull the grate off. They're stripping in between the magnets, so when the fabric gets wet, it suctions down and everything has to go over and through. Same flow rate, same sediment capture. Rated number one by Condon in New York for keeping the silica out when they're cutting concrete. So you can set it down, cut concrete, move it to the next side over and over again until it's soil laden or silica laden. Pretty neat. But we do every size, shape, with overflow, curb, without. We talked about different solutions, not the end all. This is combining other fabric, and this would be our carbon model that would coagulate the oil and grease on top of the grate. So again, depending on the application, we have the solution, and then we have the flat. So this is, I mean, the best thing since sliced bread. But if they're not going to use the straps to remove it, and they use the frames, stainless steel, but they'll bend, as you saw in my disaster. So. They came up with the Easy Catch Pro. Inverted corners for the 3067 so it gets back of the curb. We now have pieces because of Egan having it five months in place there. Where we have the curb come in and go back and under and it's just a different corner. All these corners and connectors are independent pieces as you can see. This size here is for Green Bay. They go 24 by 36. That's 18 by 36 for the rest of the state in Minnesota. All we did was replace the connector piece, same corner. So it reduces what you have to stock, stainless steel. And since I invented these and in the process, we now don't have the tabs on it because they're not needed. They just lock in. So some organizations, et cetera, are starting to rent the frames and sell the bags of replacement so we can get in that, I hate to say it, but dandy bag price or some of the lower performing product prices out there, not saying dandy bag is, but getting into that category. And being that price range, while you're getting two and a half times the flow rate, 15% more sediment capture, and just making it easier. Why is this easier? have a magnet up top curve that tucks between the grate and frame and goes all the way back to the edge. Ohio State University, Ohio DOT just did a study on ours and the other four products against it that were studied. 
And the results were, you can't raise the grate more than an eighth of an inch if you're under the grate. If you're above and below the grate, you have to have overflows above and below the grate. There's white papers on it, there's other things in it. But what's important about that is everybody's progressing, whether it's product, whether it's engineers, contractors, city officials, everything else here. But the main thing is we are progressing. So our main thing is we flow faster, capture more, make it easier. Last thing, any questions on the inlet protection? I did a really good job, didn't I? Then we go here to dewater it. Normally when you think of dewatering, you think of those big black bags that are taken up the corner of a parking lot, correct? This pump here, this bag here will handle a two or a three inch pump running full. A two inch pump would normally take a six foot by six foot non-woven bag. A three inch pump would be 10 foot by 15 foot non-woven bag. They bounce around, fill up 8% and you're done. Ours will fill 30% on their own. You're pushing the sediment back while the water is released. This will handle up to a four inch pump, five inch pump. Then we go 40 inch by 10 foot or 20 foot for up to six inch pumps. 80 inch by 10 foot, 20 or 30 for eight or nine inch pumps. But now we introduce a whole new vision on dewatering. Manifold, split that hose into three or four different bags. You can move the bags when they're full. They'll fill 60 or 70% because you're giving it more fabric space. Heck, you can stack it and use it for shoreline reinforcement at that point when the vegetation grows through if you want to get that way, which I am. That's pretty incredible. But now you've dispersed discharge points, fast and faster full, but you can turn one off, replace it while the others keep running and you've eliminated your downtime. And when you're dewatering, time's money. So now you're flowing faster, capturing more, eliminate downtime, and make